budget cuts taking center stage at school districts all across West Michigan as summer kicks into high gear. And for many districts, one of the first places cut is custodians. 24-hour news eight's Tony Taliavi is live in Jenison right now, where those job eliminations are on the agenda. Tony. Good evening, Susie. This district is talking about laying off all 16 custodians and turning that service over to a private company as a way to save money. We are expecting the affected custodians and their supporters to protest tonight in advance of the 7:30 school board meeting. Now, Jenison Public Schools is facing a 2.2 million dollar budget deficit for next year. We just talked with the superintendent. He is expected to tell the school board tonight he's going to propose using 1.1 million dollars in savings and another 1.1 million in cuts to get at that 2.2 million dollar. Figure one of the big cuts is laying off those 16 custodians. Now, when we did speak with him a few minutes ago, he pointed out the school board has cut six million dollars in spending in the past few years. He says there is very little left to cut. Came down to basically, do we lay off nine teachers, or do we um, look at providing our custodial services in a different way? And coming up at 7.30, we do expect a protest in advance of that meeting. Coming up tonight on 24 Hour News 8 at 10 on WXSP and on the news at 11, we'll be taking a look at the growing privatization trend. How many districts are doing it and is it saving them money? We're live in Jenison. Tony Tullivia, 24 Hour News 8.